Hi guys, Kevin here. Welcome back to some spin tires with Big Papa Wombat. And we're going on to the hill. I have no idea what we're doing here. It's going to be pretty much showing me what to do, hopefully. Yeah. But yeah, shit goes down, hopefully. Let's get going. I just realized I've been recording in 720p because I'm a fucking scrub. Uh, so uh, I'm going to change that for the next video. Sorry for the people looking at garbage content on my channel. <laughs> I should just commit suicide. I have garbage. Alright. Enjoy. Throw a uh, garage carriage on and then scroll down to your very bottom and take off that frontal exhaust. Oh, that destroys you, doesn't it? Yes. Yeah, you're dragging me along. It wrecks what? your what? life. What? I promise I didn't mean it. Right. What did I want? It was garage oh, trailer, wasn't it? Let me start my timer. Uh, garage carriage, yeah, not trailer. Right. Same thing. Kind of. Just a little bit different. <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> yeah, we're not gonna risk it and try and race trailers down here like we did the first time we played Hill. Let's do it. Nah. Oh. oh, shit. <laughs> Bumper cars. Beep, beep. Go! I'm trying. It's not my fault I gained weight. I have a glandular problem. It is actually that really tight cornered hill, isn't it? Yeah. Oh, I really fail at that. Just go slow. We'll be fine. I fail when I go slow. Which means don't do what I'm doing because I'm gonna like haul ass and automatic down it. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> That'll be me going like in low, just like yeah. I'm coming. It's it's, it's gonna be the tortoise and the hare. Yeah, the tortoise always wins. Yeah, it's probably because the hare is gonna end up in a tree off a mountain. Is it? Yeah, we go right here then. Mm -hmm. Before the bridge. There you are. I'm That's actually Kevin's strat there. He taught me that. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> I found that out just by randomly going right. Just... Look at the brakes on this truck right here. Ooh. Stopping on like a 65 degree incline. That's better than a Range Rover. And it's still less douchey. Okay, you're going like 5,000 miles an hour. Fuck. I'm going slow right now because I went wide. Oh. I understeered. I'm Any more down portion the front. I was going really slow because I'm going to fall off the cliff. I just like kind of tried to slide it into a corner. It didn't really work. <laughs> but I didn't go off the mountain, so. Not that bad. I think B is my parking brake. I'm gonna try and actually parking brake it into a corner. Oh, that was a bad idea. I tried <laughs> to like parking brake and do like a faint entry and uh, kind of <laughs> drove off the mountain before I even got to the parking brake part of it. A faint entry. Yeah. <laughs> I like that. Yeah. I like the idea of that. I'm just driving this truck <laughs> and you're trying to do a faint entry. I love it. I'm gonna do it. <laughs> You can tell me and Kev play far too much Forza, in my case, played far too much Forza. <laughs> I do not have the consoles anymore. Dim consoles? Oh my god. Yeah, my console days are done. That was nearly bad. Why are you saying oh my god for? That was okay. nearly bad. Kev, no more faint entries. <laughs> it wasn't even a faint entry. I just went round the corner just normally. It just didn't go very well. <laughs> Was it the uh, second corner where it's got that like muddy interior? No, it was the third one. And a really sharp. That was third. It was just like I went yeah, really wide. Better than that, Kev. It started to like turn really late, and it just, it just didn't go very well. But, yeah. Kev shit the bed. You learn from experiences. That's what all the people say. All right, let me drop this load off, and I'm gonna go pick up the. Kamas. Kamas is the big orange truck. You're gonna need to get yours too. Uh, not the orange one. It's Once game. you get up here. Joking. <laughs> it is a terrible truck, but we have to use it simply because it has fuel and it makes things quicker. Because we're gonna, uh, you're gonna put on a uh, a utility attachment, and uh, I'm gonna put on a logging attachment, just so I can go ahead and do that. And I'm still coming make up the hill. Quicker. I'm coming. That's alright. 
By the way, for those of you wondering, we didn't go over the plan for this one because there's not two uh, logging areas, so Kev doesn't have have to drive logs. So it's much less of a risk. Okay, I just got a bit lost. Alright, um... Uh, if you are you at the point where the uh, asphalt turns into dirt? Um, I think I'm in the middle of trees. Okay, well, we'll get back to the asphalt. Nah, that's fine. I can see the garage. Just got to go through the trees. I don't know that that's gonna work for you, but all right. I'm coming. Oh, I hit a tree. I don't see Kevin. Not yet. Oh wait, do you see the back? Oh, I see you now. You're. Kevin Tall, everyone. Kevin Tall. I don't know if they can see that. I hope they can. By the way, if you're wondering why it's so dark on my screen, it's because I have a mod that actually makes the nighttime dark, so if I turn off my lights like this, we can't see anything, really. Yeah, and I'm yeah. stuck. Nope, I'm not stuck anymore because I just bent the tree. That's okay. <laughs> Go! Yeah, I made it. See? Shortcut. Kevin the tree bender. Shortcut. Kevin's actually the next generation of uh, avatars. He's a tree bender. Unload. I need All the right. orange thing. All right, yeah. It? Yeah. Throw a utility tra uh, utility attachment on that first. Before you go anywhere, and then pull yourself a commas on over here, and then throw off-road wheels on it once you get it over here. Just make sure you don't take off that fuel cistern because it's got uh, 500 liters in it and that's what we need. If you couldn't tell, I've done this a few times. Nope, <laughs> couldn't tell. This is uh... Oh shit. I'm gonna pull out of the way for you. I think I went a bit too far. Okay. Uh, the commas is on the loop of asphalt. Should be coming around to it. Reversing. That is where we're heading for the people on my end. But first, we gotta go over here-ish, somewhere in that area, and get a. Uh, it's down here actually. Get an MAZ, and then we can uh, do swag things. Swag. Definitely. It's actually swag, Kevin. It's swaggy swag. <laughs> Go. Is that like a mix of swag and swiggity swoody? I'm coming for that booty. And swiggity swag. Two. <laughs> I swiggity your swag. I'm coming with the orange thingy. That's that sounds dirty. You're gonna get like a uh, flag for inappropriate content, saying things like that. Sorry. <laughs> I apologize. Am I meant to be going to the garage? Or... Yeah. yeah. One thing I uh, noticed on Twitch, uh, back when I used it more often, um, they made it so you couldn't actually make your uh, channel 18 plus anymore. So I don't know how they do that mm -hmm. anymore. So basically, I can't. Sweat. I, I don't know. You can't warn people that you swear. That's all I know. <laughs> also, you're gonna want that uh, orange truck to be a bit further away, so disconnect it and drive your roll forward a bit, and then switch back to it and put some off-road tires on it. Yeah, there you go. Um, off-road wheels, there we go. Change. And now I switch back. Switchback? There's no corners like that in this game. We don't have switchbacks. Oh. I'm not even sure what a switchback is entirely because I'm not a pro racer. Oh. oh. Well, I'm touching the track. That's good. <laughs> okay, auto and acceleration. Oh, fuck, reverse. Alright. Mm. We're just going down the hill that I came up. Well, I came through the trees, but... No, we're going a different route now. Mm. 
I'll wait here so you see where I'm at, because I can't actually see you yet. Oh, there you are. I thought I'd went completely the wrong way. No. Oh, there you are. See, all I see right now is like a glowing version of you. It's kind of like glowing your outline somewhat. That's about it. Also, you're going to want to try and shift into high as soon as possible on here. And then just hold the F key and it should make you through most of this mud. Oh god, I'm going far too fast. I'm scared. Oh my god, You're gonna make air. it, Kev. I've got air. Oh, oh How the god. hell did you get air? You don't wanna know. Kevin the stunt guy. I like how I'm just making all this, this like Rooster Teeth reference, like you're Ryan of the group. The two man group, yes, it's definitely a group. I am a dumb. Come on. Come on. Right. Come on. Yeah. And you're gonna take a right once you get down that hill, by the way. Alright, I didn't hear a confused what, so I'm assuming you uh, didn't yeah. take a left, so it's good. <laughs> See you in the distance. I was sitting there kind of. Alright, very good. Because I can't see you at all. I can't see you anymore. I was kind of reluctantly waiting. Oh, what? Oh, you can't see me anymore? Sad face. I can see you just. Yeah, if I look back, all I see is uh, a little bit of orange and some orange lights on top of the truck behind me, and that's it. What's... There is nothing else. So you're just going to follow that road straight. Oh shit. Is there any more mud? Uh, yeah, there's gonna be more mud. <laughs> Fuck. Quite a bit. Fuck. I'm coming! Oh, I got my... Oh, there you are. Alright, just follow me now. Why You're not? gonna stay connected to your truck. Okay. Because you have, uh, you have repairs, and these trucks that we're heading to are kinda damaged. Or as Gavin from Richard Keith would say, they're a bit mingy. Just a bit. Mingy! Kev, you're, uh, European. Do you know what the word mingy means? Because I don't. Yes. Is that actually a word? That's a better question. Um, it's not really a word that I use all the time. And I wouldn't really use it, but... <laughs> so I'm assuming it's a very offensive word. Yeah. <laughs> well, well, I think I, I know I don't know the means. actual meaning, but I know that minge is basically vagina. But I don't know... Minge... So it's basically it's like... It's the European equivalent to cunt in America. That's what I'm getting. I don't know, because... We say come a lot. Well, I say come a lot. Yeah, and it's not offensive to you guys, but over here, that's like you might as well be the spawn of Satan if you say that word. Really? I would not last very long. Yes. Well, I say it all the time too, but it's fucking hilarious. People get very mad. It's a good way to like win an argument just simply by making someone so incredibly mad that they can't speak. <laughs> <laughs> you just drop the sea bomb. Just like come. Yeah, that's it. You win. <laughs> and my uh, my calculus teacher is awesome because she does not mind when I drop C bombs on the stupid people in my class. As long as they're stupid. People just, <laughs> <laughs> that's pretty much what it is. And you know that she approves when she laughs along with you. It's like she's like, you just made that dumb person look dumb. High five. <laughs> not really though, because. No, I have I to teach I can't them. legally approve of such that. Yeah. 